right, John Hall, a little quick tip for you. At some point, you're going to make a mistake in your curving layout. So you can see this side is wider than this side. So how can I fix that and make it invisible so that I don't have something that looks wrong? Well, you can see I've cleaned off this side all the way to the, the side. All right, so that's cleaned off right to the side. Now I can take a piece of the curfing that I have left over and I'm going to make a little piece out of this. So you can see I took one piece of curfing, I can stick it on here and I can see how that fits. And you're going to say, aren't you going to shape this? Well, yes I am. Right now what I'm doing is I'm trying to get an idea how thick I need to make this. So I can take a chisel, cut that off, and I only need enough to go in here. So I'm now going to cut this off again and give me a little bit of room for adjustment. So I have now created a little wedge that will fit right on here. All right, And you're going to say, well that looks funny. Well, yeah it does, but you're going to see what's going to happen in a few seconds. We take a look at that, we can use any number of glues. We can use fish glue, hide glue. I don't like to use super glue here because super glue might wick through the, the mahogany and affect the finished process later. Uh, since we're doing a quick tip video, we're going to go get the super invincible glue. I'm just going to use good old fashioned tight bond because it affords me It affords me a short clamp time. Uh, I'll be able to fix this in about 15 minutes. So I'm going to put a little dab of glue, okay, just a dollop. Now I can push this in here and I'm gluing to the side and I'm gluing to the kerf. Now while that glue is setting, yes, while that glue is setting, I can take my sanding block and I'm clamping this in with my finger. And will you see it? Sure you will because you know you put it in there. The average guy won't even notice it. So now all I'm going to do is put a spring clamp on there. Give it 10 minutes. and we'll be done. From my shop to yours, John Hall, Blues Creek Guitars.